tomorrow. Lots of sunshine in the morning. It'll be hard to come by showers until the afternoon time frame where those storms will be scattered in nature. They'll be hit or miss a 50-50 shot whether or not you got some rain or not. As we head towards the middle of the week though, a little bit more cloud cover moving in, but we'll still see sunshine each day this week. Just a little bit less sun for your Wednesday and Thursday than your Monday and Tuesday with higher rain chances in the forecast as well. And then by the end of the week, a sun cloud blend with some scattered storms in the forecast once again. Can't really shake those afternoon pop up showers and storms. And the reason why we're just in a very humid atmosphere right now with a lot of humidity coming off of the Gulf of Mexico. But notice these oranges, a little bit of Saharan air is making its way in from the African coast. And that's going to help suppress thunderstorm activity as we head into your Monday morning. We can see Overnight tonight, just some passing clouds tomorrow. Bits of sunshine working its way in. The middle of the day is when we start to see a couple patches of isolated storm coverage. And that will move through the region during the afternoon hours. We'll get a couple showers and storms to move through the area. So it won't stay all that dry, even with the drier weather in store. And then as we head into the overnight hours, just passing clouds. And we'll see a sunnier start to your Tuesday as well. Temperatures falling through the 70s overnight tonight into the mid-70s for lows tomorrow morning. We warm up into the 90s tomorrow, but we'll have some periods of showers that'll cool us down into the 80s once those showers move through the area. And then overnight, we will be in the mid-70s once again before returning to the 90s our Tuesday afternoon. So a little bit warmer the next couple of days just because we'll have lower rain chances, but showers will still be around. Heading to the beach, 88 degrees, can't rule out the chance for a shower, but a moderate risk of rip currents out there. And heading out into the tropics, no tropical cyclone development expected over the next seven days. As typical for the end of July when we really see that Saharan air mass take over the Atlantic basin, make it hard for those showers and storms to pop up across the area. But uh, a detailed look here at our seven day forecast. We'll have a little bit warmer weather for your Monday and Tuesday with more sunshine throughout the day. Still those scattered afternoon storms hit or miss in nature. Doesn't mean you're going to see them, but doesn't mean you can rule them out either. As we head into Wednesday and Thursday, a little bit cooler with more cloud cover, greater rain chances, still seeing the sun during parts of the day. And then in to the weekend, partly cloudy skies with hit or miss storms.